What's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Super Cooper Sunday. Good boys. Koda, you missed the, the big exciting boxes on the table. What's up guys and welcome back. A happy Sunday to all of you out there and an extra happy Sunday to all the mothers out there. It is Mother's Day. Moms are the absolute greatest and of course here on Super Cooper Sundays. Dog moms are also a part of the mom club. All right, obviously, you know, not quite as much work as an actual child, but some days it could be considered They're kind hurting. of close. <laughs> Coop, you ready to be a good boy? Maybe make her something nice to say thank you for all the nice things she does to you? As he panics that I stop scratching him for 0.2 seconds. <laughs> some of you guys may have been around long enough to remember a few years ago, Coop, Coda, and I did a little art project in the side yard for Chels, and it was awesome. We had paint canvases and paint. I put it on the canvases, had them walk over it. It was really cool. We still have that artwork. We love it. But obviously it was quite the mess, especially Cooper afterwards. We've got a similar idea today, but uh, it's gonna be done in a much different way, much cleaner, and I think the boys are even gonna enjoy it more as well. Cooper, what's in here? Get it, good boy. We have in here some giant Ziploc bags, a set of paint brushes. I don't think we're actually gonna use these, but I thought it might be just kind of fun to have them. Maybe we will. We've also got some acrylic paint here. And then in this one, we have, go ahead and open it up, Coop. You gotta get that paper. Get the paper, good boy, get it. Get it, or we can just we can just play in it. Coda, come help him out, I think he's confused. We're trying to figure, uh, Don't maybe don't eat it. I thought the idea of this episode was minimal mess. That was the thought. I think Coop has other plans. Every day with him is a gift for you, just so you know. <laughs> anyway, we have canvases in here. All right, bud. Coop is locked up. Bella's locked up. Hopefully you've got that creative juice flowing because you're up first. The idea is we're gonna take these larger than life Ziploc bags. Never seen one that big before. <laughs> but we're gonna take this, we're gonna put peanut butter on it, we're gonna take a canvas, let the boys and girls pick out what colors they want and then kind of doll up paint all over the place, put it in the bag, they lick the top of the bag, they get peanut butter treats, they make us a cool painting. Hopefully. We'll see how it turns out. This looks nice. I'm doing my own artwork. Wow, I got a kiss. <laughs> Good boy. Really, uh, kind of here. He's think, thinking about maybe you're trying to pretend that you're kissing me and if you just accidentally got some peanut butter, that'd be okay too. <laughs> I'm not convinced. So these are gonna be your colors that you get to choose from. You gotta forget about the peanut butter for a second here, buddy. You can choose any of them you want. Oh, okay. Green. We're gonna go with the green. Okay, well we can't do just green. You have to at least have- At least two, maybe three colors if we can. I like, I also like green. I, <laughs> You made the best. You choice. made a great choice, Coda. <laughs> we need more though. Come on, get it. Get another one, buddy. Good boy. Coda, I I like green. I do. You're so right. You're so right. Pick another color. <laughs> just, I know you want. The green. <laughs> he just wants the green. Do you want purple? No. Would you? Yellow. Yellow. <laughs> okay. I'm not sure what's going on here, but. <laughs> okay. I can't. We've made an executive decision for him. We're going with pink. He likes his pink fuzzy elephants. So green, yellow, and pink. Take a look at this, Coda. This is your future masterpiece. Let's not lick it yet. Do you see? You've got you know, a nice balance of colors all over the entire thing. We did make pretty small dollops. We didn't want it to be too overpowering, so you're gonna have to lick pretty aggressively. Make sure you get good spacing and distance and nice brush strokes, you know what I mean? Tongue strokes. I think you can do it. All right. We've gotta very carefully open this up. Okay, I got it. All right, here we go. Are you ready? Let's do it, good boy. Look at that. So the thing about him is he's very methodical. Even with food and peanut butter and things like that, like Coop is always aggressive in your face all over the place. He, I feel like is gonna be a little bit more precise with his strokes. 
good boy. He is absolutely loving this. This is right up his alley. One thing, if you guys decide to try this at home, make sure you get like the smallest plastic bag you can. We've noticed that because our bag's a little bit bigger than the canvas, it's kind of popping up like you guys can see there. I also think we could have maybe used slightly bigger paint piles, but um, you know, each artist is different. He's going to be just as unique as his personality, and uh, we'll see how it turns out. He's obviously very focused on his craft. You done? Is that it? Nope. Still have some more up towards the top. He's very precise with his yeah. decision making. He stepped back, he looked, he said, no, I need, to, I need to get this. I mean, that's the sign of any great artist. He's not on canvas, but you know. Coda, we'd have to, we'll have to turn this into an NFT as well. <laughs> and of course, anybody who's ever eaten a lot of peanut butter knows just how dry your mouth gets. Well-earned bowl of water there, my friends. Coop is up next. <laughs> He's trying to tell you what to do, woman. Hurry up. Please, come on, he knows exactly what he's doing. He's done this so many times before. How are you gonna tell me what to do? Good boy, no, not me. <laughs> Goob, you gotta wait. He's watching so seriously. I know, he has so much to say about what's going on right now. Look how ready he is. <laughs> but what, he doesn't. <laughs> so, but, he, but he step two is to pick out your paint color. So get it, Go ahead. get it, good boy. Don't eat any of them, please. Just check them out. Look at these. Okay. Purple, orange, blue, yellow, pink, green. I don't see his vision, but we just gotta trust it. Must it must be there. All right, this is the moment of truth. He gets to get after it. Let the professional do his work. Good boy. Coda used all of maybe 15 minutes. Granted, we had to give him more paint, so that's not really fair, but he, I mean, he really took his time the plastic bag was clean. We, we yeah. could have brought oh, yeah. that to a Thanksgiving and served food out of it. Nobody would have known. So we'll see if Coop is as, you know, exact with his licking here, his painting, but uh, looks like he's enjoying it so far. It's looking pretty good here, Coop. Still not sure about that many colors. The orange kind of. Yeah, I did. Really the other ones there. look pretty good. The orange is a bit in your face, but maybe that's what he's going for. He is known for his orange bandana, so. That is true, and marking at orange cones and orange street signs, so maybe that was his signature color. I don't know. Is that good? <laughs> he's already cleaned himself up a bit, but he had peanut butter all over everything. <laughs> His whiskers, his nose, bottom of his chin. <laughs> good boy, you did a good job. I wouldn't say you got all of it like brother did, but um, solid try nonetheless. And now for pet number three. I'm sure she is thrilled about painting you something for Mother's Day. What colors do you wanna go with, Bella? We're looking a little more muted. A little bit angrier, a little bit moodier here. These are the only colors we have left, and I think it, it kind of works, if we're being honest. What do you think about this one? Lamp black. Dark as the night that you were dropped off on the doorstep. How about red? Oh, like the like color red. of the blood that you extract from your enemies. She liked red. <laughs> including you. Including me. Bella, do you like blue? Was that a gag? All right, Chelsea, I'm gonna do you a solid here. I've got blue, kind of a mustard, and then also the gray. We're gonna roll these, and whichever one she chooses is gonna be her third color. Go get it, go get it. It's not the blue, it's not blue. It's the mustard yellow. <laughs> yeah. Are you excited to paint her a nice photo? A nice painting, good girl. Now obviously, peanut butter is not gonna work in this situation, but we do have a little something else in mind. Catnip. Do you guys see her over there? Just having a bath in the middle of the house. 
<laughs> Let's see the reaction to this. Oh, Bella! That is a lot. That's a lot. A lot of catnip. Oh, here she comes. Oh, Lord, she is coming. What is this? <laughs> We're gonna need you to step on it. See if you just kind of assist her a little bit. See if we can... She does get a little angry and moody on it. There we go. Oh, I'm not a fan of the bag. Wow, look at that. You can step on the bag, see? It feels nice. We might get some nice paw prints in there. She's kind of okay just watching it from a distance. I don't know that she wants to get on it herself. Oh. Ow. Oh, we're stuck together. Oh, oh we're stuck together. <laughs> <laughs> I need you to retract that claw. Oh, and she put a hole in my pants. I was just getting up to help you. You're welcome. Happy Mother's Day. <laughs> we kind of got a little bit in there. I think most of it was just from the bag falling down. But she, I mean, she stepped in a couple of little spots and it, it might turn out kind of cool. I say we call it there. Some people just aren't artistic. We, we've got to support her in any endeavor she wants. So of course we're going to let these things dry. There are some big paint globs on there, so it's going to take a while. I think we're going to leave it completely overnight. We'll see you guys tomorrow and we'll check back in and see how they all did. So we picked the painting up, moved it, took it out of the bag. She instantly came back, started laying down exactly where the painting was, enjoying her nip. Yep, there's the rolling, the paw prints, everything we wanted her to do. We were supposed to do this on the paint. <sighs> she could have easily done this to make you a beautiful painting. No, she picked out red and puke yellow and then opted not to do anything. Look at her now, are you kidding me? <laughs> Okay, it's been two days. We had to let them really, really dry because we had some pretty globby parts, but we did a good job. Are you ready to show off your painting, huh? You did a good job. I think yours could be one of the best. We'll let the people decide. You guys will have to leave comments with what you, what you liked. So here we go. Wow, <laughs> he's jumping at it. Let him, let him sniff it. Look, Coda, this is how it turned out. So when we added, when we added the extra paint, that's where we got these streaks from and we feel like those turned out pretty cool. We really like the giant paw print right I there. Really like the paw print. That's our favorite part for sure. That's one of the best parts of any of the paintings. I think the colors worked well together. He chose some colors that complemented each other. Coda, well done. Koopy, your painting is up next. You see it? So we, we set it on top of the bag. This is all peanut butter juice that soaked into the back. So it's, it's really truly theirs. Go ahead and flip it. Wow, look at that one. Very abstract, very moody. So the unfortunate part is that the purple he chose ended up black. Yeah, a lot, like this all was purple and it really looks black. This was black up there, yeah. black down here. But actually the black kind of works better with the orange, so I'm not mad about it. And if you take a look here, you guys can see we didn't pull the, the you know, plastic all the way up when we were pulling the painting out, but it made a pretty cool effect. Yeah, this is actually really cool. I wouldn't be mad if the whole thing looked like that. Yeah. So, very unique, Coop, you did a good job. We're proud of you. Bella, do you wanna see your painting? All right, here we go, go ahead and flip it. Good girl, look at what you did there. You made that for her. Do you not like it? Oh, okay. No. So there you have it. That, my friends, is a wrap. I feel like they turned out pretty good. Bella's is very unique. She didn't really do much of it. That was more of us. Coda's, honestly, I really like. I think if you looked at it like this, you could almost see where it's like abstract flowers and stems. It, it's the only one that I can like see something in. So. It kind of matches your shirt. Did you plan that? No. <laughs> that's, that's pretty incredible. And then Coops, I honestly, I really like Coops. I think he just had a bit too much going on, but maybe that's the vibe he was going for. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was a blast. If you guys end up trying this at home, be sure to tag us on Twitter, on Facebook, on IG. Show us what you guys come up with, how great of artists your pets are. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys on Wednesday on the Super Cooper channel. We've actually got a love test video coming out this week, so we're gonna find out who loves who more. Also, be sure to check out the Facebook page. That's linked down there as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys next week on Super Cooper Sunday. Peace out.